Two Hollywood personalities, the wonderful screen stars, Larry Parks and Betty Garrett, and actually they're Mr. and Mrs. Parks. Here's Larry Parks and Betty Garrett back again after having smashed them at the Palladium. Hi, Hi you, Larry. Jack. Betty, nice can I? To nice to you see you. Can I, yeah, can I get you around here? Uh -huh. Because uh, otherwise we get all messed up on our picture. Right. How's the trip? Oh, just wonderful. I, I, I can't uh, tell you how wonderful it was, really. Must have been a high spot in it for you, though. It, well, I guess the opening night at the Palladium probably was the big spot. And then, of course, Paris we loved. We also love Scotland. I, I can't tell you where the high spot was. Larry, we read in the papers back here that your appearance at the Palladium was just about the biggest thing they ever had. They sold them out. They had 20 curtain calls for you, and, and, and people were waiting for weeks to get in to see you. Well, <laughs> I, we, we liked it. Let me put it that way. We liked it. From the Palladium, you went on through, through uh, Glasgow and Paris and other places, didn't well, you? Well, we played three weeks at the Palladium and one in Glasgow and then uh, vacation in Paris. You see, this is our first trip across the water, and so we tried to make the most of it. Your very first trip on a liner, then? Yes, my first one. How do you appraise it? Oh, I think it's great. <laughs> I think it's great. I'm sorry I haven't done it a long time before now. <laughs> Betty, last time you left, you had some wonderful pictures of the baby. Certainly, we must have a flock of new ones. No, no new ones yet. I, I'm expecting to see an entirely new child when I get there. <laughs> you were in this appearance then with Larry at, at the Palladium. Oh, sure. We have a real old-time vaudeville act. You mean um, with uh, straw hats, soft shoe dancing, and that Well, we have stuff? a soft shoe dance. Uh, as a matter of fact, uh, I think uh, the one uh, write-up that we're the most proudest of uh, was the most proudest of. I like that language. <laughs> That's uh, real good, isn't it? Most <laughs> proudest dove. <laughs> was uh, a variety write-up that uh, billed us as uh, Larry Parks and Betty Garrett songs, comedy, and dance. Oh, All I had to say was half tuxedos will travel. <laughs> <laughs> what about that, that somber thing that was uh, um, something that South you did America? in South oh, America? Uh, take no, it away. we didn't do. I uh, didn't do any of the old things. Everything was new, and we did everything together. We did sketches and. Uh, a uh, few dance numbers together, and then we did a couple of the numbers that we've made uh, records for, phonograph records. Slightly warm out here today, <laughs> isn't it? Larry, how about yes. uh, the new picture coming up, the one you're going to make? Well, it's, it'll be uh, the first independent. It's uh, with our partner, Lou Mandel. He's the president of the corporation, and Betty and I, and we're going to make it. It's called Stakeout. You're, um, you're sort of have producing this yourself, then? You're in on the production well, of it. Well, Lou is the producer, and uh, we're uh, partners in it. Interested in it, then. Triumvirate. You know, one of the most wonderful stories that I have ever heard on Chips Reporter is the one that we talked about last time, in which Betty uh, Garrett met Larry Parks, or vice versa, and then what happened? Do you remember? No? Uh, you I met a guy just the like so, and all well, of a sudden, bing. He said, well, how about marrying me, babe? Exactly. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> exactly true. <laughs> yeah, well, it, it happened awfully fast. We were, uh, we were married within a few months after we met, and uh, he proposed on the first date we had. On his knees? No, no. no. We were riding uh, up top Mulholland Drive in uh, California. In California? <laughs> yeah. If I didn't take him seriously, I don't think he was really serious. Was but it, it on, a, on a Fifth Avenue bus or something, the equivalent of a Fifth Avenue no, bus? No, no, it was in his little car, his little Ford. Ah. He took me riding in the, in the hills, the Hollywood Hills. <laughs> and Larry, what, what first attracted you to Betty? You, well, it's hard to say, Ooh, Jack. On, on, on your feet. It's hard to say. I'm the kind of a guy that has to take two weeks to buy a toothbrush, you <laughs> see. I have to figure out what kinds and how much they cost, but I saw... Uh, this thing here. <laughs> I said, well, uh, That's right it. now. This is it. Right now. No yes. delay. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks a lot for chatting with us. It's Thank wonderful you, meeting you. Uh, I hope we see each other uh, many times. This yeah, is we should. I'd like to make again. We should actually make this uh, an annual visit. That's a I must. I think we probably will. I think we will. Good luck right. on the new picture, Larry. Thank I'll you. I'll be very watching much. for it. Good. So are everybody else out there. Bye, Jack. <laughs> Bye. Bye.